Hey guys, I am going to be working on this locker today. I got this at Michael's for, I want to say $25. It's for keys. I am always losing my keys, so I had to have this. I kind of want to go in a Baroque slash Damask kind of style on it. I still don't know what I want to do with it. I do know that I want the base coat to be black. I don't know what I want the design color to be. I did choose a few of them here. White, gray, a metallic, teal, and my black. My black has to be a bigger bottle because I use that color the most whenever I paint something. I have some stencils here. I am going to go through them and choose which ones I want. I also got the stencils at Michael's. I got the paints at Michael's. Dollar store. Michael's. Yeah, I have some stencils here that I am going to trace with the pencil first just because I don't like to use the paint straight on the stencil. We're going to see what I'm going to end up doing with this little locker because I don't know what I want to do with it. This is what the inside looks like. I do have one set of keys that I use every single day. The other folks are going to be for like my collection of keychains that I have right now. I'm going to paint this black. I am going to do a few coats so I think I'm just going to film a little bit of that because it just gets mundane at a certain point. So I'm just going to put some music on and get to painting. Alright, I am going to switch brushes because I don't like the way that this is painting, so I'm gonna work on the next few coats. I'll see you guys back when it looks pretty decently black. I don't know when that's gonna be, but I will see you guys in a second. I am back. It's been a few days and a few coats of paints later. I'm still not happy with the black coats because you can still see some brush strokes on it. Yeah, you can tell right there. I'll fix those later. But I have my design penciled out and this is what that looks like. But I did start painting it. I'm gonna fix the mistakes later on, but I'm so excited. It looks so cool already. Yeah, this is what the front looks like. I mixed and matched some of the stencils. I'm gonna show you what stencils I used in a bit. Did the sides as well. I am super happy with how that came out. It's not completely exactly the same, but that's as close as I'm gonna get. So I went and bought a new brush. I just bought this angled brush. I guess I'll just show you the stencils right now.
yeah, let's get back to painting. I'm gonna be watching Gallivant. I've already seen it, but I'm rewatching it. I love that show so much. I've also been using this cardboard as my palette, so excuse the mess. Like a shadow dark and cold to the touch. Am I insane not to let go? All right, I think I'm gonna do the rest off camera and I will check with you guys in a few days. So I don't know how many days it's been since I last filmed, but I have cleaned up most of the front. I have a few things to fix and I filled in the letters. Pretty happy with the way that it is right now. And I also have cleaned up this side but tonight i'm gonna be focusing on this side because as you can see it's not as 
clean as the rest. This is gonna be the last clip for this video before I go on to edit. And I'm pretty excited to see the finished product. I don't even know how many hours I've spent on this, but it's been quite therapeutic. I think this will be it for this video. I'm gonna finish the white sections off camera and then I'll give you guys a shot of it finished. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!